accidentally forgot to click the record button and uh, just did like an hour's worth of progress. Basically, I raided Carter. See it on his channel. You're gonna need to see it on his channel. I stole his iron. Yeah. And also, I asserted my dominance over some dominance over some pillagers today, or I guess last Minecraft day. But now I have two banners, and I also died from fall damage. It was painful. So if Carter dies, I may or may not delete the world. I don't think I will. I'm still deciding on that. I don't think I would like to. Anyways, again, we must pay respects to Long John. Dear Long John, Long John, my lord, I am so sorry for killing you. And we gotta go check on Snowy over here. If I missed out on recording this, it was Snowy the Arctic Fox. I don't know if I recorded this or not. But, what'd you say, Carter? Snowy the Arctic Fox is still here, and Snowy the Arctic Fox just escaped. It's time to recapture Snowy the Arctic Fox. By slowly sneaking up on him while he's asleep. Like a sir. So now the Arctic Fox is trapped again. Yeah, you're just wait, you have a wall? Oh, I thought you meant like your perimeter walls or something. But yeah, I stole a lot of stuff from Carter, including iron and seeds and a bed. He's not too happy about it. And then after, on my return journey from stealing stuff to him, karma bit me in the back, and I died. Yeah, and then I found more iron, right next to where I died. And I still got 6 XP levels back out of the 12. Yeah, half a 6 is 6, Carter. Oh my gosh, the fact that you willingly accepted that was funny. Because it's not right. <laughs> uh, fun day, fun day. Time to smelt all this new iron I got and get me a full... S How am I stupid? I was making a joke about what you said. <laughs> twelve half of six is twelve, or I mean half of twelve is six. You were infecting me. You said half of six was six, and I was making I was making a joke about that. Not the same thing. It's entirely different. I didn't have to ask to say that. I don't think. No, if you'll excuse me, I'll be planting all the profits I stole from you. Oh, right, right. I agreed. Sorry, Carter. I agreed to stop. I probably should stop. I'm only going to mention it if I'm talking to the viewers. Sadly. <laughs> things are short. Things will get a... Things will get a lot sadder from here, Carter. Just so you know. <laughs> There's not even an acacia biome on this map. Anyways. The Hill of Depression. I don't remember if I said... I don't remember what I called the hill, but it's now the Hill of Depression. The more mask on it, the or the more illager banners that are on it, the more depressed the hill gets. I wish I would have done this with that illager banner that I uh, had in my playthrough. And I think I will. By the way, Luke the Notable sponsored this idea. 
Because I like the idea and I like the fact that it's funny, so I'm just going to use it. I'm taking, no, I'm taking an idea from Luke the Notable. I literally just said it out loud. I don't want people to think I'm doing it without, you know, like, announcing it, like, trying to sneakily do it. I know Luke's the Notable idea is to cover everything with illegible banners, but I'm going to do it better. I'm also going to have more, I'm going to do everything better. I always thought I had more wood, I gotta go. Oh, no, I heard smelting, smelting good. I gotta go, um, make more chest. No, I said I gotta go make more chest. No, I get off when I get off. I can get off at any time. I I'm probably gonna end up leaving around, like, uh, two. If you stay on that long, of course. Now I have more chest. I had tin clay. Um. Um. What else? You good? And more cave ambience. Nice. Well, I have more cave ambience happening right now. I'm not a fan of that. It's really terrifying. You don't understand the absolute terror I'm going through right here. I mean, if my face was scaring me, I'd be running away already. Put the wood in the wood chest. Wait, do I have more wood? Oh. This is going to be... Okay. Bro, my sign didn't work. Bro, I accidentally pushed another sign. What? Do what, Carter? Originally, I was planning to record Bendy and Ink Machine today, but I guess I can wait. Anyways, tell me when you start back up. Okay, hold up. You gotta hold up, Carter. I don't know why I made the chest labeled food, when I probably should be eating that food. I guess it's my farming chest, too, so, you know. This is my items chest. I throw random junk in there. Uh, I don't know. I'm sure your fans won't judge you for that. They might, but you don't know. I mean, I know mine wouldn't. They don't. They rarely comment. The latest comment I had on my videos was about how to play uh, Gnome Bomb mode. Do what? Mine usually take around like a day to upload. I don't know why, but it does. Anyways, it's time to expand the wheat farm. I just realized I almost just destroyed my guard. It's time for me to expand the wheat farm, which means I need more dirt. 
Hey, Carter's back. I stole your intro, by the way. Ha. Huh. I mean, no, I stole your intro. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> I've got like three episodes and I accidentally forgot to upload them. So. It w it was, it looked like testicles. Uh, I forgot to say disclaimer, everybody. <laughs> oh god, oh god. <laughs> Carter's face probably went like that, that blank expressionless face where you're concerned. Yeah, we're gonna spend uh, an hour or so remaking a house. That's a great use of time. Just like me, with this drown slowly swimming at me. Majestically swimming at me. Oh, no, now it's walking towards me. Now I will take my leave. I also accidentally just destroyed some sugar cane of mine. Well, no, not mine, really. I mean, you guys know who it really is. <laughs> not sad for me. Huh? Well, I, well, I mean, people might not watch yours because it's like five hours long, but, you know. I mean, people watch mine and they're usually like an hour or so, 30 minutes to an hour. I mean, few people watch mine, but they watch it. Hmm, interesting. I feel like I should put tags on my video saying that this is not for younger audiences. I don't intend to, I don't, I probably am going to get demonetized uploading this. I just, I just thought about that. Well, no, Grace still plays does it all the time. I mean, like, it talks about this type of stuff, but worse. So, I mean, as long as I just put, like, a disclaimer and stuff. Anyways, my farm just doubled in size. Yeah, I mean, remember I took all those seats from you. <laughs> my what? No, my farm. With the seeds I took from you. <laughs> what was that? And now I have a full set of iron armor. I'm an impressive man. I have a full set of iron armor now, Carter. <laughs> I stole all of it. I'm a great man. My children will take a... My children will know how to properly act in public. <laughs> and now I have a water bucket, so that way I do not die from fall damage again. You know what, it's time for me to invest in what car? Yeah. Yeah. You know what? I have an idea. A project, which so to speak. 
Let's see. Food, food, wood, blocks. There we go. Technically, I meant to say food, tools, wood, blocks. There we go. Grab all five. Uh, no, how many stacks of cobblestone do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six. I have six stacks of cobblestone. But if you walk over to my house, you know you'll die. I can literally watch you come approach on my house on the map. Of course you did, Carter. I'll just make a, like a, I'll start it here, I guess. It's not going to look good. It's going to be a cobblestone path. I don't know why I made walls. And I don't know why I'm making this so large either. Just. You know what? I'm gonna make a good road. Which means it involves walls. It's gonna be lit up and carved like. Again. I probably should always make roads. I used to always make roads, but. I stopped for a long time because it took a lot of effort. And I did not ever have enough cobblestone, really. I've already burnt through a stack. And I have just barely begun. Any tree that's in my way will die. Also, the fact that I'm making the road the wrong way is also kind of sad. You know, it's not worth my time making a road when I already know when the uh, where the outpost is. I can make like a dirt path, kind of, I guess. Or like a signaling block. It's not worth my time making a road. You know, it is worth my time, though. The sheep. I need a sheep farm. Do what? Hmm. Huh. You know what? I'm gonna find a village. I'm going to find a village. That's my primary goal right now. And if I see you coming to my house on the map, I will literally run over here and kill you. I feel like I should force you to come with me. Is the sun really setting now out of all times? How annoying. Look what you've done, Carter. I like the fact that I can hear drown from my house. Because I got, remember I told you I had that, um, place underneath my house or whatever. Or that, uh, that water hole. Or whatever. You know, I'm just gonna stick some, uh, more pine, or spruce saplings in a chest dedicated to food. Sleep, Carter. Sleep when it gets dark enough for us to. Oh, the drown's not, uh, oh, it just turned day again. You know what, after this night, I'm gonna go, because I probably should... Because, again, with the sleeping schedule, I gotta keep that. Uh, hey, this was fun. It's gonna be a great collab series. No, after, like, 1.30. I'm just spamming my bed right now. Also, the fact that I'm going to be sleeping with a sword in my hand is perfectly ep ethical. Oh, no, I don't think I'm using... <sighs> Sorry, I don't think I'm using that word right. But, you know, you get the point. It's dangerous. I'm probably going to wake up in the morning and then not wake up because of the fact that I have a sword through my head. Because I will drop it on my bed and then lay on it in an accident. Why can't I sleep yet? 
It's literally turning dark and then getting bright again. It's going to keep doing that, isn't it? Huh? We all are, Carter. I feel like I should have diamond armor. What do you mean, why? I deserve it. Because of the fact that I have a giant cave underneath my house, and, you know, I have barely and even tried to explore it. By the way, I will agree never to play this world unless both of us are on it. I won't play it by myself. I, I keep enough for that. Can I sleep now? Yes, finally. Sleep, Carter. Go to sleep. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. You know what? I'm going my. I don't like waiting. I don't have any torches. And cave ambience that I really did not like. Carter, please sleep. Do you want do you want me to describe the cave ambience I just heard? So it was like a giant thunderous clap with some like running people running on blocks. And the sound of a door. And I am never coming into this house again. Finally. Took you long enough. Bro, my house is bright. There's no reason to play. I was like right next to a torch when it played cave, cave, cave ambience. Holy crap. <sighs> if it takes me that much struggle to get words out of my mouth, then I'm going to have a rough day. Well, I better get to journey in. I got a long walk. I also am bringing my entire cobblestone supply. Do you know why? Hey, I'm going down that cursed ambience hallway. Okay, that scared me. My door sound effect played after, like, way after I opened the door. Bro, any loud noises happening in my house is startling me now. Okay, you know how, like, I say that nothing really bothers, like, nothing scares me, really? There's one thing that does. It's gonna sound stupid, but it's, it's like, cave ambience and stuff in this game. The creepy pastas from this game. They can't even do anything, yet they're terrifying. Like, it bothers me so much. Come on, Creeper, I want your gunpowder. I want to make TNT and blow Carter up. Huh? No. I didn't say anything. Uh, you know what? I, you know, I just realized how horrible it's going to be to traverse this biome. There's so many mountains. Hey, the sun's rising. You know what? I feel like I have a better chance of finding a village near you. Yeah, I'll come down there to the plains. <laughs> I'm coming to visit, Carter. <laughs> ah, I'm coming to say hi. Question. What would be the first thing you make when you get a bunch of a bunch of diamonds? I'd go for a pickaxe. Did you just kill a horse? You're disgraceful.
Oh, by the way, guys, I don't know if I already w You got jump scared by a beach? Ow. Oh, it's a bee! I'm getting closer, Carter. I see the outpost. I'm in the swamps near behind the outpost right now. Oh, there's a creeper. Didn't see that. It was hiding in a hole. I think lag just saved me from that creeper. Dead man now. And that gunpowder is mine. You know, holy crap, that, that, that's deep. Oh, don't laugh at that. Huh? Oh, hi, pillager outpost. I may just kill a captain while I'm here. Now that I've got full iron armor. I mainly came over here to flex at you. Okay, you are not worth my time. I'm just casually walking by these pillagers while they load the... There's no captains here. How dare you all shoot me with crossbows. Don't be disrespectful to your king. I really do not need the crossbows they drop anymore. Do what? By the way, I want to see how your new house is looking. Why are you using spruce wood? Wait, is that the wood from the tower that you stole? Why are there two beehives just floating right there? Okay. Okay. Not bad for, uh, not bad for detail. I would not say that. And I dislike you from our little war. And I'm calling your house decent. That detail is exquisite. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to be go, I'm going to be looking for a village. And claim it for my own. It will be another, it will be the first subjugated people of the Wolf Empire. What are you going to do if I find the village? That's what I want to know. What? Village! Let's go, village. You know there's a village like right around the mountain, right? By the way, if you kill everyone there, I will kill you over and over. Do not kill everyone. You will be a very dead man. Is it a skeleton horse? Oh wait, no, that's just normal white horses. But let's go, I found a village. We'll check out the village guys and I'm gonna end the video. After I imprison everyone in their houses. Cause that's capitalism. I think. <laughs> or no wait, no, capitalism is money. Capitalism equals money. Village equals money, so we're inserting a capitalist uh doctrine upon this village. This village is prospering. They have a uh, they have a wealthy man standing on top of the well, and not to mention a big iron man. I am me I'm meaning to say iron. I know it's a habit. I might kill your all's iron man.
I don't know. Holy crap, these this, these villagers are stocked on food. Without permission. I'm an animal, I must ask for permission. Yeah, all these villagers are getting locked in their houses later. I was... Hold on a second. Okay, Carter, I'm back. So I keep losing my phone earlier. I I lose. I, I lose. I lost my phone earlier, like twice, and I couldn't find the stupid. I had to turn off the light. I couldn't find the stupid phone earlier. These villagers are harvesting the wheat before I can. That means I must harvest faster. All the seeds are mine. Oh, these villagers are sl these villagers are slowly harvesting while I'm literally taking every single piece of crop they have. Do you know what I'm gonna end up doing to this village? Do you? What type of plant is this? This is carrots. Give me all the carrots. I am going to make this into a trade profiting center where villagers will be extorted. I will become the richest man in this world. <laughs> yeah, I get it, I get it. Oh my god, I think that's... They don't have a blacksmith here. I can fix that. And I will fix that. And no village is a village. This is not a village. There are men walking on the roofs of their houses. Why? Okay, first thing that's gotta be fixed is I gotta trap every single one of these villagers in their houses. It's the place where there's a llama stuck in the well, and there's a villager on top. All of you head for your houses. I must lock you in there. Probably not a good idea to tell them this. Can you hear the bell ringing? Okay, so far I got two farmers running for the hills. I might also kill all your livestock. Just want to mention that. And he's in his house. No, not you. You don't have any livestock. I was talking about the villagers. Remember, my goal is to uh, export trades. Increase trading to the max over right here. Oh, I found a, uh, one of those good worker, village, good working villagers. Go to your houses. Don't make me ring this again. Hurry. Go. Are you just going to stand there froze? I will trap you in place. Bro, this guy's so dumb. He literally just stood there confused, not looking like he didn't know what to do. You know, I don't even have to trap them in their houses. I'll just trap them in these stone areas right here. I can release the villagers when I finish walling up the village. But anyways, guys, I'm going to end the recording here, seeing that I'm eight minutes overdue. Make sure to like, subscribe, comment down below, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you all in the next episode of this wonderful playthrough, where we're going to be uh, doing totally ethical stuff with people. Have a nice day.